Hello everyone and welcome back to my Macedon playthrough in Emperor's Edition. Uh, my name is Pope. I guess I should probably <laughs> apologize for the stupid episode uh, that was previous to this. Uh, with the battle I had at Tarsus and I lost all those units. Uh, really annoying. I'm actually not even gonna keep some of these. Uh, I guess the hoplites I can not keep, but I want to get Thurio Spears. Or some kind of other swords. Um, which reminds me, since I have the auxiliary for everyone, auxilia for everyone mod, um, which pretty much lets you get auxiliary units just like Romans do, uh, I would probably want to put an auxiliary barracks. Um, well, it's not, it, the Periochus camp is what's gonna give me auxiliary units um, here in here, or here somewhere. Um, I started one, I'm gonna actually, the, the plan was to put one in Rhodes or anywhere in, in, the, in the Asia Promise province because that will give me auxiliary Rhodian slingers. I forget about this boat here. Um, and we are going to push on to the Seleucids and so on. I was speaking at Diplomacy and a couple of things uh, came up that I want to ask your opinion. First off is Rome is uh, fairly weak, balance of power. I clicked on cartridge, sorry about that. Rome, even weaker. And they're getting hit by cartridge and by the Etruscan League and some other people there. So do I wait for them to die and then take over the lands? Um, I don't know. I don't know. Also, the expansionism, the the negative bonus to diplomacy. Expansionism used to be a thing that kind of went away after a while. If you stopped expanding, and then you can expand again. And once that that negative thing went away, is that still a thing? I don't know if that is still a thing in this patch or. It used to be around. I remember playing even older Total War games. Uh, the Noria I could probably trade with, but they're not friendly enough. Greetings! Okay. Speak plainly and without. So I thought. Also, the other thing I noticed is that um, Seleucids are not very happy, and also Sardis has captured a territory here, so they're not dead. I thought they'd be dead. Um, but yeah, the Seleucids. I will listen carefully to your words and then give judgment. So, greetings and now business. Business. They would join my confederation. So I think I'm gonna do it. The gods love peace with honor. So well done in this matter. The treaty is welcome. Yay! So, <laughs> so I instantly expanded uh, by two, three. Four regions? No, don't. What are you doing? That's not where I'm at. Because uh, I'm, I'm in this. Okay. Back to here. So. Armenia have Jerusalem. I guess Sardis are way down there. I'm not even sure how they got down there. Um. Winds of Oranos. Um, you know, actually, that's not. It's not bad. I can probably keep some of these guys. Um. So let's not change their name, but we will. Ready for battle. Heracleidae. Oh, Spear Camel, that's awesome. Citizen Cab, Eastern Spearmen. Mercenary Persian Archers. Uh, I don't need these guys. Eastern Slingers. Thorax Pikemen. Not bad. So let's call these guys something else. Since they were Seleucid. Uh, and they were 
uh, I guess, smart enough, clever enough to join us, but also strong enough to realize that they could be useful in other ways. I don't know, Seleucus might? I think I can go with Seleucus might, because it was pretty, you know, they're pretty strong. And then this will be one of our forces going forward. General Air Aeropos, my as my phone buzzes and telling me that um, that I have a message. Um, so one second here, let me actually reply to that. Okay, so we made a big, big, big um, expen expansion move. Big improvement in our in our gain. Uh, let's see what sort of Egypt I'm friendly with. Why are you out here, though? Armenia. My guess is that you lost things. Pharaoh, the light of his people, bids me welcome you and listen carefully and respectfully to your embassy. Do I want to be friendly with Egypt? Um. I think for now I do, but I think we'll just do a defensive alliance. Pharaoh strength. That gave me... You honor me with your worthy presence. I am but a humble servant of Pharaoh, lord of all true men. That does give me access to their lands. Hercules we has on me. Skills. Um, companions, hello, obviously. And foreign territory, missile units, melee units. I'm gonna go spearmen. Um, sure. Well, where can you move to? I don't want to see the line. I don't know, but let's... Let's see. I think we're gonna... Um, check... on Galatia. Um... Don't really like them there, so I might turn on them. Uh, let's move you over here. Oh, you can move today. All right. Let's end turn. Let's not end turn yet. Uh, warfare, partisan. You. Uh, yeah, actually, that's that's what I want. It's got the training there. The you went up in skill. Mm, Patriots, good. Experiments, experience for infantry and cavalry. Huh. Which way do we go?
Yeah, I don't know. I've never done camp administrator all the way up, so let's do that. Fun, isn't it? <laughs> Nicely acquired some land. Um, in fact, I think I have seven out of eight armies now, so I could technically try to do that with someone else before too long. We'll see. We'll see who. Kind of running out of Greek um, states. Peace negotiated. So what happened here? Illyrian Confederation. Oh, hello. I am trading with them. Okay. Why don't we just, uh... Well met, friend. No. Sit and let your words move me to anger or agreement, as you wish of them. I'm just not gonna have it, huh? Well, just in case, my friends, we will have to Ready for battle. recruit some units. But actually, no, I don't want to recruit any units because because the new land ac acquired will need all sorts of upgrades. Okay, so we have a hoplite barracks. This one needs to change into the one Poseidon. Athena, control to Ares. I don't know, let's to Zeus. I wanna keep this. I don't know if I wanna keep this. Library. Should I get this library? Uh. We hunger for battle. You guys are cool. The shield bearers. Uh, let's go down this way to protect. I want oh, that's all you can go. All right. Protect that border. We hunger for battle. Convert this to the Periogos camp. That was obviously the same region, and we're gonna get this Periogos camp here. Uh, actually, not yet. Need to improve. Other things. Interesting, you can just do just a sacred grove. What does that give us? I have no idea. Agriculture. Okay. So Zeus has the, the big one at the end. But I think my favorite was uh, Poseidon. 
the fact that it gives you food. <laughs> it's pretty neat. All right, so we um, we will go for Poseidon here. Get that food. And now maybe we can train a unit here. I don't actually know if I need one. The auxiliaries are getting XP rank for some reason. Ah, forget it. Yeah, I mean that first turn. I mean, we did more in that first turn than we did in a while. Do any of these hillmen? These hillmen are kind of crap, aren't they? Um, javelins. But they're fire pots. So. Let's get rid of these. Probably train something else later, but uh, oh, we have ferocious warrior on the water, huh? Uh, we will need range. Archer. Wow, look at all these cool looking things. Uh, anything for shot per minute. Authority when leading a fleet. Uh, is there anything else for fleets? Two coin forgers, never gonna use those guys. Never gonna use them because they're. It is an honor to um, serve. What was this? Okay. <laughs> Foundling, everything I possess, I made or took with these two hands. Interesting. I thought it was like an ugly one since it sort of a bad one so this looks sort of ugly and you know not happy I guess it's sort of he is cunning he might get like oh he is super cunning he's deceiver of all worlds mm. the victory sip not really I offer this in the name of our people. Let this be a sign of goodwill to come. Why don't you do alliance instead? Huh? It's like the same thing, only then you can't backstab me right away. Maybe I should give him access, you know, see what you do. Okay, do we want uh... <laughs> I don't know, it doesn't really matter, I guess. It's early on, it's just a trade. You guys... Can I afford? I have 7 out of 8, 3 or 4. Let's see. I kind of feel sorry for... Are these? What are you? Welcome. The day is already old, and there is much to do. So if you have words, oh. speak them. You're now a strappy of freaking Armenia. You used to be a strappy of bloody Seleucid. 
Uh, why the heck would you sell out to Armenians? Well, that's a lot of money for trade, but I'm gonna have to, I'm gonna have to fight them. I want, to, I want the land for myself. You know what I mean. If you know what I mean. What can we train out here? Nothing. We can train absolutely nothing. Hmm. Snail vats. Purple dye. I guess that's a good thing. Yes, I'll keep that. Why do I... I don't need this mine. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know what I need. I need to, um... We hunger for battle. March on Armenia is what I need. So, we're gonna move these guys here. We're gonna... Uh, not that. We're gonna just... First click and upgrade them all for 2,000. Give them armor and weapon bonus. Ready for battle. Uh, we have to... I guess this gave us Thoreau Spears. Thoreau Spears. Alright, swordsman. Oh, we have white shields. Holy <laughs> cannoli. Uh, Antigonid Peltest. That's another unit from a mod. Where? Oh, there is a Spears. Thurio Spears. Get two of those. And I kind of want to. I mean. Eventually, I'll get rid of these slingers and get Rodian slingers, but I kind of want to smell those peltas. Look at those things. White shields. Bronze shield phalanx. It's a pikeman. Good, good history on, on the left there. You guys got to check this guy's unit mods if you haven't. Champ Lou, he won the award for best unit mods. And we have the Cilian Cav. Oh my gosh. Oh, that is beautiful. Okay, so. Macedon's finest got even more fine. Because I'm gonna get two of those. And I don't know what the last one will be. I'll probably have to put a siege weapon in here. To make the enemy sort of YOLO charge at you. Always fast. Always satisfying to have him just charge and you're like, nope, charge my bikes. Okay, I think that's all I'm gonna do. Um, actually, I can. This one gave me the slingers right away. But. Let's upgrade. To. I guess maritime commerce is what I need. I have two ports here, so I should probably do the Poseidon. All right, guys. All right, guys. Thank you so much for being patient and watching my series. I will continue this, so look for another episode tomorrow. Uh, don't forget to hit the like button. It really helps a lot. And uh, subscribe comment and um, be good times I'll see you next time bye